My name is Melvin Nickerson. I'm a staff attorney at the Environmental Law and Policy Center. I work on legislative and policy development uh, work. EOPC is providing technical support in drafting uh, Illinois' electronic recycling bill. So we're doing everything from uh, developing policy uh, around the bill to negotiating with uh, various stakeholders to advocating for the bill with uh, legislative uh, officials. The big problem with e-waste going into landfill is these products contain toxic materials such as lead, mercury, arsenic, beryllium. Going into a landfill uh, creates a ticking toxic time bomb. Uh, it doesn't ultimately solve the problem, it just delays dealing with the problem. Uh, in a landfill, the uh, adjacent uh, groundwater may become contaminated through leaching, uh, and actually the soil itself is not going to be good for uh, much, if any, use if it has these types of materials uh, in the ground. So by taking these products uh, out of a landfill, or banning them from a landfill, more accurately said, uh, we can begin to reuse these materials to increase uh, their lifespan and also to make the uh, engineering process, the manufacturing process, more efficient. First and foremost, uh, this is an environmental win. Uh, products like televisions, computers, printers, all contain toxic uh, toxins and uh, this bill would allow or ban these items from uh, landfills. Uh, the second win is that in doing so, it would require manufacturers to uh, recycle these materials uh, for free. So the second win is that Illinois residents would be able to recycle these products for free. The third big win for Illinois residents is that by requiring manufacturers to recycle these products, uh, they in turn have to look for Illinois businesses to recycle their products. And doing so, that's going to create jobs and revenue for Illinois residents. Illinois' electronic recycling bill is a great initiative to capture consumer electronic products and from 2010 going forward, uh, capture all obsolete uh, household consumer products. Primarily the big four polluters, which are televisions, computers, laptops, uh, as well as printers. Um, this is incredibly important at a time in which we see the great turnover of uh, technology making uh, numerous products obsolete. For example, uh, televisions uh, will become uh, obsolete, analog televisions will become obsolete unless they have a digital converter. Um, so in the future, as these types of initiatives take place, as the technology changes to make uh, these this type of technology more efficient, uh, upgrades and so on and so forth, we will now have an opportunity to capture all of those products as they become obsolete. If you'd like to help us secure this victory, the best thing that you can do is visit uh, the Environmental Law and Policy Center's website. It'll provide you with information on how to contact your state uh, legislative officials and will also provide you with additional information on uh, this issue. So we encourage you to, uh, to participate. This is a worthwhile uh, bill, one that's good for the environment, uh, one that's good for job development, and uh, one that is good for electronic consumers in the state of Illinois.